And the question wants to know, uh, you know what are the removable and non-removable discontinuities? So fill in the blank. Removable and non-removable discontinuities. What are they? Right? The removable and non-removable. So solution. So something happens to the bottom of this fraction. What can you do on the bottom? Yeah, what's that called? F -f factor! Yeah, factors, I hope. If I did it right, right? D does it? Okay, okay, good, good. Starting to sweat. All right, f of x. This is, why, this is why I messed up in my other class and I lost points when I was on this board. It's like trauma. x plus 1, right? And then on the bottom, I think there's an x here and there's an x here, because they have to multiply to x squared. Two numbers that multiply to 2 and add to 3. 2 and 1, 2 and 1, 1 and 2. And they're both pl plus or minus? Plus, yeah, plus. Beautiful. What cancels now? X plus 1. By the way, obviously negative 2 and negative 1 are discontinuities, right? It's not, so these, these, are the, these, are, these are discounts. I usually don't write this on the board, but why not? Let's be different. It's a new decade. So these are the discontinuities, right? <laughs> negative two and negative one. Yeah, it is a new decade, right? I read that on the internet somewhere. Like, oh, it's like, oh, new decade. Like, whoa. Like, it's right. It's the beginning, 2020. It's kind of crazy, right? Nuts. So this cancels. So you get one over x plus two. You probably don't remember this, but I'll ask anyways. <clears throat> when you have the canceling like this, in a rational function, which is this. What is that in a graph? It's a, it's a what? It's a hole. It's a hole! Yeah, it's a hole. It's a little hole. So whenever this cancels in, a, in, in something like this, it's got to be a rational function, okay? If you have absolute values, game over. It's got to be like this, like x's and x's. Um, if you have something like this, you have a hole at x equals negative 1, right? Holes are always removable. So holes are always removable. So holes in a rational function, let me, let me take that back, holes in a rational function are removable. But what's a rational function? A polynomial over a polynomial, right? So you have powers of x and everything's a whole number over powers of x and everything's a whole number. That's what a polynomial is, okay? It's like x cubed is a polynomial. Square root of x, not a polynomial, right? So holes in rational functions are always removable. And then here, we can find something here. This, if you, if you set this equal to zero, you get negative 2, right? What is that in the graph? Do you all remember a v v vertical asymptote? Yeah! This is a VA, right? It's a vertical asymptote. So VA, so x equals negative 2 is a VA, right? Vertical asymptotes are always non-removable. So I'll come over here and write that down in a minute. So holes in rational functions are always removable. Vertical asymptotes are always non-removable.